okay guys so uh, now uh, if you open the cmd and if you check php dash v that means versions 8.2.17 currently the php version i am using so if you open the laravon right click as you can see i have four flavors 7 7.4 8.0 8.1 8.2 php versions okay so now uh, i need another php version which is 8.3 which is the latest version of the php family so uh, if i need the version then uh, i have to download the php version first so this is the first step then i have to keep the files in my laravan setup so i can change the php versions from the panel so this is the second step third step if you're using the composer you have to change the directory or the environment variables okay so let's go to the download uh, php uh, 8.3 okay just type the php 8.3 or download php 8.3 if you click on the download button so this is the official website of the php php.net download slash dot php okay so this is 8.3 version this is the latest version of the php family so 14 march 2024 as you can see it's 17 march so i think three days three days ago three to four days ago so if you click on the download button since i'm using the windows 11 so that's why i have clicked on this one so if you want to download the tar file you can just click on this one you can also download some other versions available here i'm just downloading the windows version okay so if you find the latest version 8.3 you have few choices few a lot of choices so you have the source code you have the test packages and also you have the zip file and with the debug tag i'm going to download the zip version so as you can see it's protected with shade 256 so this is algorithm or encrypted algorithm okay so now uh, i'm going to download the 8.3 version i have or I am going to complete the first step. The second step, you have to keep these files here in C drive. Since I have installed my Laragon in my C drive, so that's why I'm here. Go to the bin, go to the PHP. I have to keep those files here. So once you keep those files here, then you have to change the PHP version by going to the PHP and by going to the PHP and here 8.2 version. Fine. So 8.3 is not here because we have to download first and then we have to migrate the files so these are the files available here as you can see so this is the php.exe file okay so now uh, i'm going to copy all these files so now i have to keep the file here so now right click i'm going to extract with the same name folder make sure if you are extracting here or if you are going to break and drop files here it's not gonna work so that means you are adding all these files here in this php directory so that's why we have keep all our file in this directory now once again right click php as you can see now we have the 8.3.4 version we just change the php version now okay stop the server or the laragon and then you have to start the server okay so how can you verify either it's working or not since i'm using a file i'm saying php uh, 8.2 this is the file it's saying 8.3.4 version php you are using okay so if if it's showing you this version make sure this is the index.php file index.php file index.php file and i have just used php info functions over there so that's why it's showing us this information okay so you have to verify from the command prompt like php dash v as you can see when you accessing the file it's showing you 8.3.4 version but when you check with your command from it's saying 8.2.17 version this is the drawback okay why because so if you are using the composer 
so whenever you are installing the composer or install the composer composer always need the php script the php.exe file so at that time you gave the 8.2 versions of the php so now you have the 8.3 versions of the php so you have to download the composer or you have to remove the composer here composer I am saying go to the program and composer remove or this version. I am saying remove all things. So now you have to download the fresh composer version. So type the composer, go to the composer download the composer files download the exe files of the composer so i have already downloaded or just downloaded click on this one now you have to change the php so as you can see fine next it's showing you 8.2.17 version still so you have to change from here if it's showing from the drop down if not just click on the file from here okay so now i'm saying 8.3 copy the path now paste the path here 8.3 select the php version as you can see this is the php but in 8.3.4 version which we have just downloaded i am saying add this php to your path it will replace the existing entry confirm to continue to access control of the localizations or location sorry not localization that means it's adding the environment variables if you are going to use the proxy fine otherwise next install and boom you are ready to go next and finish okay so if you once again check the php version it will give you the 8.2 version you have to close the windows and you have to open another cmd command and now php dash v boom you have 8.3.4 version wizard one two three go okay so now you have successfully migrated from 8.2 to 8.3 or you have successfully updated upgraded the php version by using the laragor So I hope guys you are enjoying our videos. If you think we are doing good, thumbs up and feel free to share our courses with your friends, especially on social networks. So thank you for watching.